to go to Sainsbury's to pick up a couple of bits and I'm going to open my Bath and Body Works box, my last delivery, but I just thought I'd quickly give you an update. So I'm just waiting on the builders to send me over a quote to replace the garage. This is being done on permitted development. It runs the whole length of the house. It's really long. So the plan is to take that down, extend it out another metre so it's much, much wider. And then that will be an open plan sit kitchen, dining, living area, a bathroom and a bedroom at the front. So we're just waiting. One of them has got availability in about three weeks. It's quite a small job and they're a big firm. So I think they move lots of builders about. So and it is someone we know. So hopefully that'll be really good. So I'm going to do um, a separate video with a walkthrough using our software that we use when we design what we're going to do. And the architect at the moment, we've done all the technical drawings and all the things builders need to quote. And what we're going to do um, next is he's going to resubmit planning because we're going up two storey here and then a huge kitchen diner at the back. So I'll just give you a quick update on that. And I'm now off to Sainsbury's to grab a few bits. So I'll share what I find. I am in Sainsbury's and I have come to get a jumper. So I thought I'd show you what I've got. They're very nice. They've actually got some really nice autumn stuff in at the moment. Um, I've picked one thing up so far. These are really, really soft. I've got so much bedding. Not bedding. Nightwear in an evening long. If you're looking for soft, they are £12 and £8 for the bottoms. These are really soft. £14.
they do, I've just noticed, they do the pots in different colours. So they do this, this big one, this is humongous, is 45. Oh, it's really heavy. That's the 25 pound one. So no one's bought one since I pulled that apart yesterday. But they do it in these colours. So I'm gonna get one out. I think I might get a big one. So this is the oval dish. And this is 45 and you get a silver hand that goes on there in the colours and if that's five litres that's huge that's really good and I quite like the shallow one I've got these would be 200 plus quid if it was the cruise zone that's 45 and they've got a nice shallow dish yeah I'm not going to get one I'm not actually going to get one because I've remembered I've got two white ones that I bought Rob for Christmas I don't actually need one, but they are lovely. If you're looking for one, 35 quid for that one. Very nice. Quite a good station in Sainsbury's. So I'm back from Sainsbury's and I'm going to show you what I bought. Now, not all of this is mine. A couple of things my mum actually bought, but I'm going to show you my autumn fashion hauls. Now this actually my mother bought and this was 20 pounds and it's a shirt, like a fake shirt. doesn't go all the way up. Really lovely and soft fabric. And for 20 quid, it says blended with recycled fibers. But that was really nice. They only seem to do it in this colour. So that's what we got. That was £20. This dress, which I think I might borrow, if I'm completely honest. How nice is this? I love the neck detail. So that's the front. That tapping is mini walking around. And it's kind of to the knee dress with this really nice pattern. And then it goes down super soft. That was. 22 pounds so i really like that what a gorgeous color for autumn so she bought that i bought this jumper they only had it in i think i got it in a 14 or they had it in size 20 so it i thought i'd like it to come up big so i got that one and it says smile but it's super soft really nice jumper just that across the front and that was 20 pounds so that's nice. Because all the jumpers I buy tend to be really dark, like the one I've got on. So I thought, well, that's a really nice jumper to have for autumn. So I bought that. And but not too thick. I'd love to be able to wear those roll neck ones, but I can't wear those because they make my neck itch. <laughs> so I bought this really nice and thin jumper dress with little pockets. So I thought it's kind of smart to you know, wear it with boots. It's got nice little detail on one side with some buttons and then the arms are ridged and it came in like a mustard colour, black, loads of different colours and it was £16 which I thought was really good. That's the sort of thing like in necks you'd see it'd be like 32 quid wouldn't it? That was £16, it's a really lovely material so I bought that. And then finally I haven't got a heavy looking coat, I don't know too I bought this coat and it's not mega thick. It's actually reasonably thin. So I thought that's really good because then you can layer it up. They did these in a few different colors, big buttons, which are nice. It was 28 pounds. I got a 12 and that was nice and roomy on me so I can fit a jumper underneath it, but it wasn't too thick, which I quite liked because sometimes I think they're too thick. So they had these in loads of colors. It's got pockets and uh, yeah, so I bought that. So that is what I bought from Sainsbury's. They had loads of lovely stuff. I didn't buy the, the Crusoe rip-off jars, things. But yeah, how nice is that? So that is what I bought in Sainsbury's. So the other thing that's just arrived is my, I think my last Bath and Body Works order from America. Because now we can travel back. I am going to America in December. So this is the last one 
again another autumn one and a few odd ones this is a new one this is turquoise waters gorgeous so that's a hand wash i've got loads of hand wash i only got a couple but i had to get this firecracker these are in the sale and i will dig out the invoice somewhere but it, yeah these were down to 375 dollars which is just under three pounds each in the sale so only bought two because i've got loads and let me show you the candles these in the sale these candles were down to 14 dollars 50 which i think is 11 pounds and they sell these for 20 we well, don't sell any of these actually on next they sell the standard ones for 25 quid so if you want to see how cheap it is to buy for america i'll link my other video below where i cost out how i made a huge saving shipping it from the uk than buying it next but anyway this one oh my goodness look at the lid <gasps> This is Wicked Apple. How good is this to use around Halloween? I love the packaging. That is amazing. And the dog is just trying to, Minnie! Yeah, the dog is just trying to, anyway. Uh, I got a classic. I got the classic leaves. I don't remember it having a bronzy color top before, but this is a beautiful one as well. That was down to $14.50. Then I bought, pumpkin apple which is just amazing i think this is the one i bought lot when i last went to america and brought it back it smells amazing then i got pumpkin cinnamon bun it's a definite flavor running through i like cinnamon and i like pumpkin this is amazing as well and i have these lit every day so and actually i like all these and that's a white barn one as well i actually like these all the time now this one's nice it's got a white lid and this is pumpkin pecan waffle, which just smells amazing. So I'm definitely stocked up with my new candles. But I'll link in the description below how I import these and how it's cheaper to buy from America when it's a really good American sale. So you can have a little look. So that's the latest order. My last one. I can't wait to film myself in the Bath and Body Workshop in America in December. I think I might light this one for a little bit and see what it smells like because I've got a perfect little spot for it on my new fireplace. I uh, hope you enjoyed that little haul and I will see you on the next video which will be my fireplace makeover.